Hello, welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I'm going to give you a little update about how things are going in Flagstaff right now. I'm taking a little trip to the emergency room in this video and to the grocery store. Uh, so to see what's going on, join me now. Hello, it's Katanya Hartwell. Um, and today, I had to bring my daughter to the hospital in Flagstaff because she's having some um, pretty severe abdominal pain. So I just dropped her off. I'm not allowed to stay in the hospital because of the COVID-19 situation. And um, I have to be careful, so I'm just videoing myself here. Uh, but I can tell you a little bit about it. I'd love to kind of flip the camera around and show you, but they're not allowing that. So um, we came here to the emergency room at Flagstaff Medical Center and there were still parking spaces. Um, it's not full, so that's uh, interesting for right now. I think a lot of people are staying home if they don't need to be at the hospital, which is great. Uh, we currently have four, six, six cases of uh, confirmed COVID in Flagstaff, and eight cases in Coconino County, Northern Arizona area. Uh, there is a yellow tent outside of the Flagstaff Medical Center uh, emergency room entrance, and they're using that to pre-screen patients, but people, uh, potential patients before they go in. Uh, also, like I said, as a precaution, I'm not allowed to stay in there with my daughter. So um, if you are coming with somebody, um, I probably start at the screening tent. Uh, it was interesting, I guess, because there's there really the the there weren't many people here. The emergency room uh, waiting area was completely empty. Um, they had my daughter go through the first sliding glass door. There were some seats in there. They had her wait in there. Um, everyone is very protected with masks and um, face uh, plastic face screens. Um, they're wearing. So a lot of precautions, not being inundated just yet. Um, I kind of wish, uh, so my daughter was having uh, more severe symptoms yesterday and uh, she was with some friends who said, well, let's not go to the hospital because, you know, it might be easier to catch COVID-19 if you go there. I kind of wish they'd gone, <laughs> but we didn't know the situation. Um, yeah. So hoping to hear back soon and I'll just be waiting out here for her to get done. Hey, it's March 20th, about noon, and I'm gonna go in and shop at Safeway on Milton. All right, so here I am at Safeway on Milton and turn the camera around. There's a lot more produce than there was last time I was here. That's how much on the cleaning supplies. Still on my little paper pad. Uh, maybe a little bit of facial tissue. Not much in the meat department. Bit, 
update looks like my daughter did have a kidney stone she got some medicine for that and uh, they think the worst of it is past so that's good news uh, and she's feeling a lot better so yay they got her in and out of the hospital very quickly and that was a blessing thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time